Hello YouTube, it's your girl, me, Viva, and welcome back to my channel, and welcome back to my Sims 4 Let's Play with me, Chris, Ayana, and hopefully our new, brand new, newborn baby that will hopefully come out this uh, part, hopefully, I mean... I'm really desperate for this baby to come out and I didn't know if it's gonna come out or not but anyways um happy Saturday I am recording a Saturday night I normally don't record at night I'm supposed to be in the bed right now cuz I got work early in the morning but uh, I had to record a video for you guys even though I didn't have the time that I wanted to to record it earlier I'm very dedicated to you guys so yeah so by the time you see this it'll probably be Sunday but I'm just gonna go ahead and ask you how your Saturday and this Sunday was mine was pretty good if you want to ask me I am well thank you <laughs> but uh anyways quick recap of last episode what we did was we went to shopping well i went shopping with ayana and we went to the mall and we bought some baby stuff and we decorated the baby's nursery that's what we did and uh yeah that's pretty much all that happened so anyways it is monday morning that means it is a school day so ayana here is up bright and early what is that um you could put that away and she's going to have herself, I have nothing in the refrigerator. She's going to have herself some cereal this morning before she go to school. And what am I doing? I'm going to go use the bathroom because I got to go really bad. Like, look at that belly. Hopefully, I'm only having one baby because my stomach is huge. But uh, I'm really hoping that uh, we have this baby this part. That's what I'm really hoping for. I'm really up before. But what I'm going to do, I wish I was up before Ayana so I could cook her a proper breakfast. But um, yeah, she woke up before me. So I'm going to, actually I'm going to serve some breakfast. No, I'm going to have some breakfast. Chris can make him something when he wakes up. I'm going to make myself... um. Some silly gummy bear pancakes. We haven't made those in a while, so that's what I'm gonna do. Why Ayana here? I just got nothing but my drawers on. I have no shame in my game. <laughs> She's gonna sit here and watch the kitty channel. She'll be going off to school in a little bit, and we're gonna have her make some friends today. Uh, I can't wait for her to age up. Like it seems like it's taking a long time. She will be aging up in nine days, you guys. Nine freaking days. We'll have our first teenager on our hands. But I'm really just, just really, really crossing my fingers that we have this baby today. That's all I'm waiting for. As you can see, I'm in my third trimester and I could give birth whenever. I have no clue. I have no idea. I'm just hoping that it'll be very soon. Look at me. Remember at the beginning of my LP when I was so bad at cooking? I'm almost like a pro now. Like, what is my <laughs> cooking skill at? I don't think it's that high. Oh, no, it is pretty high. That's like my highest skill I have. And as I say that, and I drop a pancake on the ground and put it right back in the pan like nothing even happened. <laughs> I am level 8, almost 9 in cooking. Now I'm level 9 in cooking. I should do something cooking wise. So Christopher is up this morning. And what? Oh, Ayanna want to hug him before she go off to school. Oh, no, she going to go steal his shoes. Never mind. Just never mind. He wanted to hug her, but she was like, Daddy, yeah, I'm gonna play with your shoes. But uh, she's going off to school. Bye, baby. Bye. I'm glad she didn't steal her dad's shoes and put them down. So, what we're gonna have to do is uh, I forgot that you can actually make friends now with that update. So, we're gonna have her make some friends. And what is Chris coming to do? He's like, I couldn't hug Ayana, so I'm gonna hug you this morning. Oh, yeah. oh loving. But we're gonna have Chris to uh, pee like a champion. Why not? And uh, take a. Let's have him take a energized shower. I feel like Chris haven't not energized a brisk shower. I feel like Chris haven't went on a morning jog in a while, so that's what we're gonna have him to do after he make himself something to eat because i i normally cook for him i always said that i'm also gonna cook for him whatever whatever but um he's gonna cook himself some breakfast this morning i'm gonna change into something well clean out spoiled food and i'm gonna change to something a little more appropriate and maybe i will go on a morning jog this morning to maybe induce this labor to make it happen a little bit faster because i have no idea so uh yeah i'm gonna go jogging i'm pretty sure when you're pregnant you're not actually jogging you're just walking which is cool i could go for a nice walk as i water myself out the front door 
I mean, I deserve it. Maybe it'll help with this baby coming. I don't know. But we're going to see. I don't remember what my athletic outfit looked like. That tells you how long it's been since we've been uh, working out, which we're definitely going to do once this baby come out. We're going to get back to working out like we supposed to. So, yeah, my, my outfit didn't really change. I'm just going on a nice old stroll this morning. Just walking it. Just walking it. Who's that guy? I think he might be in an athletic career. Who is that? I can't see your name. Your name is, what's it? Archer? Oh, there go Justin. Justin and Amber. We haven't talked to Amber in a while. Oh, now my outfit finally changed. <laughs> Look at that belly. You better work, girl. You better work, girl. But he is cute. I, well, I'm not going to say nothing, but he is cute, though. But let's check in on Christopher while I'm taking my little jog slash walk really walking not jogging at all and uh then we're gonna have him go for a morning jog and then he's gonna come back and he's gonna finish up studying his opponents because oh no you don't have to do that really he doesn't work today which is good so that means i need to have the baby today so chris don't have to miss work and he could uh come to the hospital with me as i have this baby of his which would definitely not be the last. I'm like, how long have this LP been going on? We only have two kids. That's crazy. But then he's going to go on an energized run. And then we're going to do a little gardening together. We haven't did a couple gardening in a while. But really, it's all about the waiting game this episode. Hoping that our baby come this episode. <laughs> I'll be really, really happy. And I'm really hoping that it's a boy. And hopefully only one baby. Because my stomach look you like huge like beyond huge why am i going to work am i really going to work no i went to work are you kidding me oh my god i totally forgot about <laughs> work because uh, i haven't been to work in like almost a week it feels like but uh it was my first day back to work today and i did not get my skills up i didn't do anything to prepare because i should have been getting a, a promotion but um yeah i'm still gonna work for now i said i wanted to quit my job but um we need more <laughs> income at the moment before i could just straight focus on my clothing store which we probably won't be attending for a little while i want to you know work because i do make a, a lot of money from the current job that i'm doing but uh it looks like i don't know i don't know if it's just me or if it's anybody else game but my sims they take a long time to change their clothes like he just changed that's so weird but i think we're getting a patch or an update or something um this week because all of the sim gurus they changed their um display pictures on twitter to like a bat gnome like a batman gnome and uh everybody's saying oh that means we're gonna get something very soon so we will see definitely whenever it happens uh i will be making a video on it because i i don't know what it could be i have like no idea i'm going to I'm going to take it easy at work. I mean, I could go into labor at any time now. And uh, I don't want to miss anything. So we're going to be focused on Chris for the meantime. And it seems like Ayana is not in a good mood. She is, oh no, our baby is sick. She's feeling feverish. Ayana is hot, like super hot and not that good. Ready for her close up kind of way. Oh, okay. So, oh, here it comes labor i knew it was gonna happen i knew i shouldn't have went to work okay here we go gone into labor chantelle is bursting with anticipation to meet her new bundle of joy that is so accurate but i did make some money today so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the hospital but first just first i gotta change out of this ugly work attire i mean look at it just look at it Look at Chris, you see him through the window. He's like freaking out. So I'm going to change my outfit first and then we're going to go to the hospital in a little bit. Make sure that my knees are all good before we go though. And we're going to go to the hospital. I'm so excited. Our 
Second baby is going to be our first baby that we give birth to at the hospital. And we're going to invite Chris, of course. Why would we invite anybody else? So by the time Ayana gets home, she's going to be greeting her new baby sister or brother. And I get to show you guys the mod once the baby is born. So I'm so excited about that. We didn't have to wait too long. I'm very, very happy. But um, while the hospital is loaded, I'm going to take me a drink. I'm like mad thirsty. And here we go. Chris oh, is just freaking out. Chris is like, I don't know what to do. But I mean, like, he shouldn't be that freaked out because it's like, it's not our first baby. <laughs> it's the second. Chris should know what the deal by now. But I just want to take a picture of this. Like, this is just a great shot right there. I couldn't pass that up. Okay, so we're going to walk up in here and give birth to our baby. I guess this is the doctor that's going to do it. London De La Cruz. Oh, I love her name. I love her name. So here I go. Come on, Chris. Let's do this. He got to be in the room when we're doing this. He's got to. Um, What do we do here? What do we do? Um, Why am I dancing? I stay dancing at like the wrong times. Um, I need to check in. So we're going to check in at the front desk. And Chris just want to talk to me. He he always just want to talk to me. Like, the first time I was in labor, he wanted to talk to me, right? Like, Chris, what are you doing? So I'm going to check in here. And Chris is just following me because he don't know what else to do. <laughs> okay, so I'm all checked in, hopefully, by Brianna here. And um, I guess I just have to wait till the doctor is ready to see me. I don't know how long that's gonna take. I have no idea. Um, lady, lady, Chris, where are you going? Can I like deliver my baby now? What is Chris doing? Really, Chris, you panic and run, and then you like the only thing to calm my nerve is to play The Sims One right now. Thank you so much, Christopher. Am I going in now? I think I'm going in. So we're gonna have Chris get off that computer so he could be in here. Where's, where's the doctor? Which room am I, am I going into? I have no idea. But we're just going to make sure Chris hurry up and get there. I think I'm going... No, I'm going to this room. Darn it. <laughs> Chris, go into the other room. I'm about to do this. Oh, my God. I'm scared. <laughs> Look at my face like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. But, you know, I got to get my pictures in as we wait for Chris to come through the door. Yeah, so got me laying here getting ready. We're gonna go ahead and play. We're gonna do this like movie style for you guys. Where's Chris? Chris? Chris better come through that door. There he go. You gotta be here to witness this, Chris. I'm just saying. He's still freaking out. Poor thing. Okay, here we go. I'm so scared. It's, this does not look like a good procedure at all. She don't know what she doing. And I'm about to give birth. Oops. I'm missing it. Wait. Here we go. <laughs> Got my. Um, she took out my heart. I just died. I just freaking died on the table. Oh my god. And we had what? What is it? It just froze. What do we have? We had a boy. Oh my god. <laughs> Yes, 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 yes. So I guess even though you play in separate files, you will have the same gender baby because in my other save file, I had a boy. So we had a boy. You know, I always wanted a boy. So let's read it. Congratulations. It's a boy. Birth, life, the universe, and everything await. It'll be a long road, kid. Chantel just gave birth to a baby boy. This baby needs a name. What would you like to call him? And of course... Thank you all for leaving the cute baby names in the previous two parts ago. Like two parts ago, you guys love cute baby names. That's what I asked for in case I had like twins or I had a girl. So I am still have a chance of having twins or whatever. But we got a boy and I always said I already had a boy name picked out. So the boy name I have is Kayam. So welcome to the LP, our baby boy, Kayam Brown. And I only had one baby, thank the Lord. 
Oh, let me get. There he is. Look at him. He's so cute. Look at him. And Chris went right <laughs> to him to pick him up. Like, as soon as he lay down, he's like, Here go our baby. So, as you guys see, um, let me take a picture first. Just, just take a picture. Kayam looks different than what Ayana looked when she was a baby because I put in a different set of CC uh, skin, baby skin. So, uh, yeah, there go Kayam. How cute he has on a red shirt. You know, I love red anyway. But, um, yeah, there go our baby. Our baby boy, and we already have a good relationship with him. I want to do something with him before... Uh, they ship him on home and hopefully the mod work like it's supposed to chris get out of my way darn i didn't even get to interact with him because chris was in the way um and of course chris will hug me after everything is said and done so he must be proud <laughs> very very proud um yeah so hopefully the mod is working correctly if not we get an issue but uh hopefully it's working so i can show you uh exactly what's going on here once we get home so we will see definitely we'll see whenever we'll this decide to load up <laughs> uh, 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 uh. oh we got bills chris pay the bills chris pay the bills okay let's see where is kayam and i'm oh there he goes so the mod does work but before we look at him i'm still in the freaking hospital scrubs i didn't know that you could like come home in the hospital scrubs anyway so as you can see kayam here is floating in the air and he is not attached to a crib which is good because that means i could place kayam anywhere in this room <laughs> that's the whole point so this little cc crib that i downloaded i could put him on there i could put him on the changing table i could put him on the playpen uh, in the play uh mat not playpen in the play mat so of course how you do that is just simply moving the baby around it's basically the crib is there but it's just like invisible or transparent or whatever you want to call it so if you have like the move objects on cheat of course you can move the baby up so it could be on a change the table and you could change the baby and um and um like you could just place the babies anywhere and it works better <laughs> if i could use the right button if you have uh the move objects on cheat as you can see, he is now on the play mat. Or, um, let's pick him up again. Let's turn him around here. And, uh, let's put him all the way back down. And, uh, most of the stuff is, like, normal height to work with things such as this custom crib. So, as you can see, uh, he's all the way down at the lowest he could be. And he fits comfortably in this custom content crib. So, yeah. Let's go give Kayam some loving. That's what we're gonna do. Um, let's um, let's bounce our baby boy. I'm so excited, and make silly faces and feed him. We're going to breastfeed him, of course. And Chris here, he's just gonna he pay the bills. So Chris is great right now. We're gonna have a uh, Chris to come out here and do some gardening, and I'm going to help him in a little bit. Um. Or maybe I won't, because it seems like most of it is done. All I have to do is harvest. So here's Kayam, and I'm crazy. Well, I'm not crazy. I'm just, I didn't think I would still be in the hospital uh, gown. I think I said hospital scrubs at first. I don't know why, but uh, the hospital gown. As you can see, it's like a little, it's not perfect. But um, you basically could do it. Or put the baby anywhere and everywhere now because they are not technically attached to the crib anymore or what it appears to look like but uh yeah so that's Kayam we're giving him some love and we're finding some more eggs I did want to collect all the eggs so we're gonna see what we got and um because the eggs are supposed to be done by now but um they're not so soon probably not after this because I'm going to bed after this but um Soon, of course, I'll be taking some pictures of our now full family at the current state that it is with Kayam. I know I've been taking pictures on Tumblr and Instagram of me and Chris. And you saw that my 
belly was gone because I was using the other foul. And uh, we already had Kayam in that foul. So that's why it was the way it was. So um, I don't know what I'm doing, but I need to get out of this hospital gown. And we're going to have Ayana to interact with her new baby brother very soon. So now I could put on my other outfit where I could show my belly now. <laughs> Boom. And you know what I'm going to do first off? I'm going to come over here and I'm going to... um. I'm going to I'm going to kiss my husband here and then I'm gonna go for a jog because I'm already trying to get rid of the baby fat <laughs> and uh Ayana is already eating she need to do homework I don't know if she met anybody at school I want her to invite Princeton over that's what we're going to do after she's done eating but she's all in our group chat I don't know why I'm in a group chat I should be going jogging and Chris here, he is going to, I feel like he hasn't talked to August or Justin in a while. So let's have him call up August and Justin. They're, they're like not even friends anymore. We haven't chilled with the celebrities in a while and uh, we need to go and do that. Maybe next part um, we will go out or throw a party or something and invite all the celebs and uh, see how that goes. So we're going to have Ayanna clean this up, and she's going to change her outfit. I don't like that outfit anymore. And we're going to change her outfit to her everyday three. And she's going to invite over. First, I want her to meet her new baby brother that she didn't get a chance to see. Oh, never mind. He's sleeping. We're not going to disturb him from sleeping. And she's going to invite Princeton over. I want her to take some selfies with Princeton. Oh, not selfies really, but some pictures with Princeton and see how those turn out. And I'm not sure if kids could do homework together because that would be like great. But uh, we're going to have her use the bathroom as we wait for Princeton. I got to push Chris' shoes back where they belong. I need to like lock her out of our bedroom. <laughs> um, But what I'm going to do, because since I'm back at work, I need to work on my programming so that's what i'm going to do i'm going to program and i'm going to do some freelance work so that way we could also make some money at the same time and uh what what is that what did that say i think that's the job i'm doing my phone icon seemed drab and dull could you write an application that would make all of the icons wear tuxedos now that would be fancy <laughs> um what is ayana is princeton coming i'm not sure we're gonna have ayana to sit here and chris he could do whatever chris want to do <laughs> he could actually continue to study his opponents because he works tomorrow is princeton coming or not it said he was coming, right? Or did it say he was busy? Oh, it said Princeton is already here. Where is he? Princeton. Oh, there he go. He's right over here. I don't know where he's going. Maybe he's going home. I don't know. Um, Ask him to hang out, Ayana. If you could catch up to him. Run, girl. Run. Like, where do you think you're going, Princeton? Where do you think you're going? Princeton, what's up? Come to my house, Princeton. We're trying to be best buds. People like, once they age up, they should date each other. I mean, that would be cute, but we got to see. I don't know what Princeton looked like as a teenager. He might not be as cute as he is now. <laughs> so we're going to talk about school and joke about boogers, I guess, because boys like gross things like that, right? <laughs> and we're going to monkey around and uh, make fun of adults. We're trying to be like best buds. And enthused about candy and play make-believe and then we're gonna take a picture with him which is gonna be so cute i wish that adults and kids could take pictures together but for some reason they can't i don't know why ea did that but it's like only kids could take pictures with kids and above can only take pictures with each other so it's like no adult to any other age range together which is crazy he's thinking about dirt bikes oh they're so cute look at them be all mean and stuff. Well, they're not being mean. They playing around, but they so cute. 
<laughs> this episode was supposed to be all about our baby, but we're like focusing on Ay Ayana and Princeton. Which is totally fine. I want them to take a picture together so I could post it on like Instagram tonight. <laughs> I'm like, they're so cute. And oh yeah, our family photo wall is still blank. I've been totally forgetting about taking pictures of us, which I will probably really focus on next part is taking pictures of our family and uh, putting those pictures on that blank wall that we have in our room. Hurry up and take a picture, y'all. Just chatting away. Just chatting. Just chatting. I just want to get a few pictures in. Here we go. Oh, look at them. Aren't they adorable? And, uh, ooh, I feel like I'm about to burp. <laughs> Let's brighten it up a little bit. And I'm going to take my own little picture with my screen capture here. And then we're going to actually take the picture. Here we go. Let's do another one to see if we could get a different pose. Take a picture with Princeton again, please. Oh, this lady got the, the CC purse on before I can even wear it. You go, girl. You go. <laughs> oh, look at them. They are so cute. How freaking cute is that? Let's move it over a little bit more so I can see her face more. And take my own little personal picture. <laughs> and then we're going to take the picture. How cute. Oh, and then they hug. Can he, like, go to your house? Because I thought he was just going to come over anyway, but I guess not. Hmm. Can we invite him to our house? So then she could do her homework. Because, like, her bedtime is, like, in two hours. So she need to do homework and eat dinner and all that good stuff but we're not gonna get to see all that before i end the episode but that's totally fine totally but we're gonna see if we can invite him to our house i mean we're not technically there there okay so i guess we can't do that okay well tell him goodbye and then you're gonna come on over where the house at? Okay. <laughs> and then you're going to come in here and sit down and do your homework. Le wait, let's see if Kayam is up. Is Kayam up? Yeah, Kayam is up. Don't sit down. I want you to interact with your new baby brother. And you're going to coo at him and talk. And then we're going to end the episode on that note. I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. I wanted him to be at our house, but he was already walking by. So, I don't know. I don't know if there's a way to, like, invite them to your house when you're not inside of the house. I, I don't know. I don't know. But uh, we're going to have Ayana interact with Kayam here. Let me know what you guys think of that name. I think it's really, really cute. And uh, I just had to use it. I always been on my mind. Like, can you... Oh, look at them interacting so cute of course it looks a little funny because uh the actual crib is not there so she seems like she's farther away but um yeah <laughs> so we're going to stop right here and um wrap it up right here so uh yeah like this video up if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new um let me know if you think me and chris should go ahead and uh try to procreate another baby right away or wait a little bit of time before we try to do that and um yeah i really want to know and also let me know what you think about ayana and princeton and should they become even closer of friends and then you know possibly you know prepare themselves to date when they become teenagers which we still have a little while on i might actually age up ayana a little bit before time i mean she has nine days that seems like that's gonna be a long time that's actually gonna be like nine parts if i'm playing like day by day like i usually do so um probably when it gets down to like four days i will age her up so and i will probably age up princeton the same day as well maybe off camera or on camera i don't know but uh yeah 
Like this video up if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. We're getting closer and closer to a thousand subscribers. So please support me by liking this video and sharing it and commenting with all the feedback that you have. I will really, really appreciate it. So uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Viva La Juicy. Peace. <laughs>